Fashion Tamer bringing you guys another wonderful Monday Makeup Madness video. And this video is not even a tutorial, it's more so of a makeup review. It's a makeup product review. And yes, it is about the eyeshadow that I have on right now. We decided to do something different for you guys and do a half cut crease with a hint of smoky purple, pinks, and all that loveliness to end summer correctly. So, the palette that we're gonna end up talking about today is the infamous Juvia's Place Warrior 3 palette. That's right, we didn't tame up, but I wish we could tame up, but I am bringing this review from myself personally to tell you guys that Juvia's Place palettes are probably like the best thing smoking out here especially if you're a woman of color and you want colors to pop and be vibrant on you check out juvia's place and trust me there's a lot more videos from juvia's place that i have coming because i have all their palettes and i will be reviewing every last one of them to give you guys the details the good the bad and the ugly on them uh like i said this is actually called the warrior three if you remember uh, years ago when they first came out with the warrior when they came out with the warrior palette It was around the same matter of fact it was in within the same year that black panther had came out. So Kind of got some good vibes going out there. So when they came out with the warrior 3 it was literally a full-fledged frenzy and the colors that's in this palette is Stupid remarkable. So let's just stop talking. Let's just get into it. Let's just talk about it Let's go Starting off when you walk when you when you walk off when you open up the palette you get the great detailing of the actual artwork which is the same artwork that's on the outside of it. Um, everything about this I love I love the colors I love the vibrantness of it where you got your blues purple pinks and your gold and they didn't put in, incorporate that green that's in there but I love the fact that they threw that green in there to kind of give you a different contrast of colors. Uh, if you know about any any Juvia's Place palettes, they are based off of the inspiration of Africa. It is a black-owned company, and I know that they have been getting a lot of a lot of frenzy out here in the streets. But hey, it is what it is. I don't knock her, make your coin. It is what it is. I still support her because she gives out a great product. I don't care what she does on how she gets her product up there. She makes a good product, and I support that. Uh, but all the colors are very pigmented. It definitely looks like you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. ten. That is not ten. Boy, I cannot count. That's horrible. It's six, seven, eight, nine. You get nine colors. I don't know where I got ten. Counting too fast. Got excited. But you get six colors that are mattifying and then you get two cut nope you get seven colors that are mattifying because i almost forgot this little blue one right here and you get two colors that are actually uh kind of metallic so that's how metallic it is and the pigmentation come on now and that's just a metallic one so if we take that purple yes that's how pigment it is so, I know you guys are wondering what is on my lids right now. So, I end up using Jarwa. I'm not going to lie to you. I suck at names, so I'm going to murder this, so it's okay. Judge me not. I use I used Jarwa, and I use the color Candace. And, yes, I use the color Candace because my name is Candace. So, judge me not. And I did take another color from the Nubian 3 palette, which we'll discuss a little bit later. But yes, definitely check this out. I love everything about this company. It is worth the money. So if you guys actually want me to sh do a full-fledged tutorial on how I created this look, definitely leave a comment below. And as always, if this video was informative and to you guys like it, make sure you like, share, and subscribe to this channel. Make sure you hit that bell at the top to be notified when I, Fashion Tamer, the Tame One, drops another video. And until we meet again, my Tame Raiders, bye.